Broadcasting another NFL game from the city of Green Bay. As the season winds down, this matchup looks like it'll be another great one. Each team preparing all week for this battle as the Broncos get set to take on the Packers. Both teams eager to get today's action started, so let's go to the field. From the three. Number 86 accelerates and takes it down to the 34. They'll First and ten. At the 34 yard line. First and ten. Let's do our thing. Let's do our thing. Hold the look. The backs are lined up in an eye. Number 94 is there for the tackle at the 34. Even though it didn't work on that play, I like that strategy. They get their back running full speed around end, looking to match him one-on-one -on -one with the smallest guy in the field. Second so it's and second and ten. All on the 34-yard line. Watch him, man. Set. Hey, hey, hey. Watch the snap now. With the pass. Swain is there on the stop the at the 41. Good throw, good catch to move the chains. You know, as a receiver, all you have to do is get a step, and this guy's going to put the ball on you. First ball on the 41-yard line. Ball on the 41-yard line. Hey, watch the screen. They ain't got nothing. Say Wilson, the deep back. And off to the tailback. Vaughn is there for the tackle at the 37. A tough running game will make your passing attack even more effective. And he picks up about four. Second and six. Ball on the 37 yard line. Will, Will, Will. We like a practice rule. Wilson, the lone setback. Number 82, the motion man. Gets the pass off. Pass falls in for place. Holt was his intended target. Third and six. Ball on the 37 yard line. Let us dictate. No stop, no stop that motor. Denver comes out in their nickel pack. Come on. Run, Jack. Three shoot. Gets the call. Williams comes up to make the play at the 35. They're sort of in field goal range, but it would have to be a long one. Give his team the lead for this field goal attempt. The what a kick. He's one of those guys who really works hard at what he does. And you can see that hard work paying off when you make a kick like this one. Sends it sailing. This one is fielded by Terry. Denver is trying to take the lead on this drive as they take over. The Broncos will start the drive at the 20 yard line. First and 10. Let's go. Come on. Terry comes in motion. to the tailback. Benson is there on the stop at the 26-yard line. A solid running game starts with a blocking of the offensive line. But the ball carrier must have good vision so he can take advantage of the holes that they open up. 
second and four. Ball on the 26-yard line. Here we go, baby. Hey, watch the ball. Beck lines up behind his fullback in the eye. Cross play to the right. Brooks is there for the and tackle with the carry. 28 yard, yard line. This team's play. always trying to get a good mix of run and pass plays. Defense! Defense! Ball on their own two. 28. Ball on the 28 yard line. play on third and short. Gets rid of it. Complete to the wide receiver. And this one will be spotted at the 47. They convert for the first down on that throw. They ran the perfect play to get those couple of yards. First and ten. Ball on the 47 yard line. Green Bay comes out in their nickel package. Dropping back to pass on first down. Throws it. Benson is there for the tackle at the 48. Watch this hit. He gets his helmet right under his chin and wham, he takes him straight to the turf. Trying to get the ball to Brooks and the coverage on the play. Third and six. Ball on the 48 yard line. Get it up! He'll go from the shotgun. Everything you got. Dropping back. Steps up. Closing in. He won't get away. Great play tonight in there for the sack. Clearly, the offensive line is having a lot of trouble getting it together. You have to be able to protect the quarterback in that type of situation. It's going to take a little longer to find the open man or the hole in the zone. And you got to find a way to give him that extra time that he needs. Maddox comes into the game for the punt. Number 86 is the deep return man. He signals for a fair catch. Fair catch made at the 18-yard line. It's first and ten. Start the drive at the 18-yard line. First and ten. Hey, watch that screen! The Broncos with a four-man front. Buckley is there on the stop at the 24-yard line. When your offensive line is getting a good push up front, it's a lot easier to pick up yardage on the ground. Second and four. Ball on the 24-yard line. Three shoot. Danny, Danny, Danny. Left, left. Denver comes out in a 4-3. They give it to the halfback. Williams is there for the tackle at the 27-yard line. Third and maybe one. With the counter play. Strongly. Smith comes up to make the play at the 35 yard line. This is tough running here. Let's watch him as he gets through right here. And he breaks a tackle and keeps moving forward. I'll tell you, this guy's hard to bring down. tackles. Ball on their own 45. Ball on the 45-yard line. 
The Broncos with a four-man front. Slips the tackle. Smith is there on the stop at the 45. The defender got into the backfield, but he managed to escape and get the first down. That's what every good back needs, the ability to get past that first tackle, especially if he's in your backfield. Denver comes out in a 4-3. Little misdirection. Number 57 is there for the tackle at the 49. Right now, they need to keep going at the defense with a run. Sooner or later, they'll be able to break one for a big game. So a pickup of maybe three. Ball at midfield. Denver using three linebackers. Here we go, baby. Here comes the blitz. Throwing. And it's complete. The 30, the 20, the 10. And they get him down inside the five to save the touchdown. Nice call going to the air, and that'll move the chain. They're just three yards away from the end zone. Wilson, the lone setback. He gave it to the halfback. It's free. The Packers scoop it up. The offense recovers its own fumble. Two yards to go for the touchdown. Two yard run. It's showtime, baby. They ain't got nothing. So a fly to the end zone. Touchdown, Green Bay. The veteran tight end holds it in for six. He does a great job here of avoiding the jam at the line of scrimmage and giving his quarterback a window in the end zone. Comes in for the extra point. The extra, the extra point, point attempt, attempt is good. Now that's just the type of thing that you come to expect from these guys. They do a really good job scripting the plays that they're going to be running. And they do a great job of executing them when they run them. chance will return here just about ready to get this drive started after being forced to punt on their last possession first, first and ten, ten. Ball on the out of the eye formation strong sends a man in motion Receives the handoff. Stiff rock the defender to the ground. Brooks comes up to make the play at the 23. He was looking for a place to run, but all those places were filled up with guys waiting to tackle him. Second and seven. Ball on the 23 yard line. play runs through the tackle Peterson is there on the stop at the 29 yard line this team's always trying to get a good mix of run and pass plays it's third down and a yard so put this one in the air trying to convert pressure coming throwing and he makes the grab a powerful arm brings them a first down this time. Not only did the quarterback show off his strong arm, but the receiver displayed some amazingly soft hands. A great throw with an even better catch is always an easy way to pick up first down. Ball on their own 47. 
Give it to the halfback. They'll go with the play fake. The pass is picked off. Perfect timing as he goes up to grab the off-target throw. The coach is always talking about his contributions on defense. And you can see why when he makes plays like that. Let me tell you, he's a guy that you got to be careful of when you're trying to throw the ball into the area that he's covering. Hey, watch the screen. Only one man in the backfield. Number eight with a man in motion. A little misdirection. Shakes off the tackle. Buckley drags the ball Wilson carrier down the behind the line. Now let's have a look at what play. our runners have done up to this point. Right. It's second down and a long way to go. On the 48 yard line. Has jumped out to an early lead as the first quarter the comes is. to a close. Green the score Green Bay 10, 10. Denver 0. Nothing. The team has looked signs and will start quarter. the second quarter. Right. Ball on the 48 yard line. Ball on the 48 yard line. Hey, let's go one deep. Let's turn it up deep. Denver using three linebackers. Right. Pass looking for the end zone. Well, Missed opportunity right there. Is there on the stop at the eight? Watch it here. This is a great call on third down to keep this drive alive. They were in a tough spot here, but this is a heck of a throw and catch to pick up that first down. Touching him. comes in to attempt the point after. The extra point attempt is good. Another drive, John, that results in a touchdown, and this game is quickly getting out of hand. This defense has a solid core of players. They just don't seem to be playing very well in this one. They still have to go, and maybe they can turn things around. But they have to find a way to swing the momentum in their favor. This one is taken by Terry. The defense looking for a second straight interception. Ball on their own 20. Start to drive at the 20 yard line. First and 10. Strong with a man in motion. Throws it. He goes up and grabs it. Gonzalez is there on the stop. And a flag on the play. This one, I think, is on the defense. Pass on appearance on the defense. Number 29, first down. Thomas is the injured player on the field. They'll be coming out for this next play, so we'll find out what the story is. So they have first and ten here. Ball on the 38-yard line. Here we go, baby. Let's go. 
Green Bay comes out in their nickel package. Peterson comes up to make the play at the 41-yard line. Back takes the pitch for a gain of three. Let's make it four. It's second down and seven to go. The injury sustained earlier was minor, and they expect him to return to the game after a series or two. With the pass, and it's caught. Number 58 is there on the stop at the 49-yard line. They completed the pass for a first down. And they did it against the cover, too. So the quarterback found a soft spot, and he got it in there. First Ball right around midfield. Ball on the 49-yard line. Only one man back. Hand off to the tailback. Gonzalez comes up to make the play at the 48. So after that run, we can see how the two main threats on the ground have fared so far. Ball at midfield. Ball on the 48-yard Hey, let's go one deep. They soft, man. The Packers come out of the nickel pack. Throwing. Incomplete pass. Henry was the intended receiver on that play. As they get ready for this third down play, we'll take a look at how they've done today. The Packers come out in a dime package. Gets rid of it. He hits his receiver. Brooks is there on the stop at the 34-yard line. Brooks is getting up very slowly. It looks like he'll head toward the sideline and we'll get you an injury report as quickly as possible. Thomas returns to the game after being shaken up earlier. Looking for room. They'll go with a play fake. With the pass, number 29 is there for the tackle at the 29-yard line. Beat the blitz, decent game. He never seems to rush back there in the pocket. He takes his time, finds his man, and puts it right on the money. Eighth play of this drive. Ball on the 29-yard line. Back to the lone back. Throws to the end zone. Drops the interception. Oh, man, he had it in the end zone, but dropped it. One person breathing a sigh of relief is a quarterback. And this is the ninth play of this drive. So an update now on the injury. It doesn't appear to be anything serious, and his return is probable. Pressure with the pass. Broken up. Seymour was there on the cover. Perry, the intended receiver on the play. Walter leads the field goal team out of the game for the attempt. The, the veteran connecting for good. the field goal. He's one of those guys who really works hard at what he does. And you can see that hard work paying off when you make a kick like this one. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one is handled by number 86. Kick they hit back out onto the field run. after scoring the right, touchdown in their the last possession, and the passing game worked to perfection. So we'd expect them to try to continue to do the same thing and move the ball through the air against this defense. The ball on their own 27. The drive at the 27 yard line. First and 10. The Broncos line up in a 4-3. Keep it off. Gets it. Williams comes up to make the play at the 32. So let's take a look at how this back compares to the opposition. Right. 
Brooks. He's back in there He's after getting shot. taken out with an injury there earlier. The Broncos come out in a 4-3. Gives the ball off. Number 57 is well, we'll there for the, the tackle at the 35. The when you run the ball in the first half, you're trying to keep the defense honest. But if you're only getting gains like that in the second half, then it puts more pressure on your passing game. Third it's two. third down, two to ball go. The yard line. Wilson, the lone back. He gets the carry. Vaughn stops the play in the backfield. They can't get the first down on that running play. And since they're not in field goal range, we should see the punt unit. Terry is back to receive this kick. And he chooses not to return this one. Now you start to look around and you figure who are the go-to guys? The guys who can respond and get this game close again. The Broncos will start the drive at the 29-yard line. First and 10. Only one man in the backfield. Hand it off to the back. Zaman is there on the stop. On the at the 32, that rumbles forward for a gain of four. Ball on their own 32. Ball on the 32-yard line. Come on! Steps up. Throwing. Gonzalez is there for the tackle at the 37-yard line. That was a good read. He was looking for the deeper guy who was covered, and he made a quick decision to go to the receiver who would get him close to a first down. Pickup of about five. Third and two. Ball on the 37-yard line. Big stop, dude, big stop. Let's go. Green Bay comes out in your nickel package. With the throw, Benson comes up to make the play at the 42-yard line. This is good communication between the quarterback and his receiver to keep the chains moving. They know where the first down marker is, and they recognize the type of coverage the defense is playing. The ball is there, and so is the catch. They both now on the chain, chain. One back. Hunts throws it. Incomplete pass. The short pass falling to the turf and it'll be second down. Second and ten. Ball on the 42 yard line. Here we go. There we go, baby. Rock and roll. He gets the carry. Fakes the handoff. Deep throw. It's going the other way. The alert cornerback gets the interception. He has a way of becoming a receiver. He just shadows so well. So they're ready to go on offense after the interception. They'll start at the 35-yard line. Number eight, back in the shotgun. Davis moves in motion. Hand it off to the back. Williams is there on the stop. Good play by the linebacker to get into the backfield and stop the play for no gain. I'll tell you, that comes from watching a lot of film and knowing the tendencies of the opponent. That was a heck of a play. Two-minute warning coming up. Ball on the 33-yard line. Let's turn it up, DZ. Be careful. Aims it on. Nice play fake. This pass is incomplete. Pass Not one of his better throws of missing long. Receiver on the play. Right. Almost at the two-minute mark now. Ball on the 33-yard line. Out of the eye formation. Gotta keep up Dropping back. Gets rid of it. 37 is there for the tackle 
Watch it here. This is a great call on third down to keep this drive alive. They were in a tough spot here, but this is a heck of a throw and catch to pick up that first down. So after that nice catch and run, here's a look at his stats. Little misdirection. Smith comes up to make the play. You can't have a good running attack without blocking. But blocking alone won't get you what you need. You got to have a back who can find the holes when they're there. Second and one coming up. The Broncos line up in a 4-3. With the throw, complete to the wide receiver. Number 37 makes the tackle at the 29-yard line. When you think about guys with great hands, he's very close to the top, John. I'll tell you what. He does a great job of using his hands and not letting the ball get into his body. He's worked very hard to improve his pass catching. I think he's become one of the best out there. Only one man in the backfield. Looking for the long completion. He's there for the catch. Touchdown, Touchdown Green Bay. Perfect throw against single coverage. Touchdown. Kicker lines up for the point after. The extra point, point attempt is good. good. That touchdown now, John, puts them up by three scores, and we're not even at the half. They're a scoring machine. The coaches are calling the right plays against the defense, and the players are executing perfectly. This one is fielded by Terry. The Broncos face an uphill battle as they begin this drive at the 20 yard line. First, First and 10. Ball on the 20 yard line. Let's do our thing. Let's do our thing. One of us will make a play. Strong yeah. will work out of the shotgun. Yeah. Closing in. Gets rid of it. Gonzalez makes the stop at the 24-yard line. Strong appears to have sustained an injury and will make his way to the sideline under his own power. Ball on their own 24. Ball on the 24-yard line. Let's go, be good. Green Bay comes out with seven in the secondary. With the throw, he finds his man. Dotson picks up next to nothing on that one. The pass goes for about a yard. You know what this does? It keeps one defense on the field. And it doesn't let him get the right personnel in there sometimes. Just about a minute left. We saw the injured player go to the locker room earlier. Word is he suffered a deep bruise to his quadriceps and will be out for the rest of the game. The pass was incomplete. Good defense and three and out series are the way to keep your defense fresh and rested. So they'll line up the punt after going three and out. He's waving for the fair catch. Fair catch made at the 40-yard line. So they have first and 10-yard line. 
First and ten. Let's go. The Broncos with a four-man front. He hands it off. Great move to get free. Boston is there on the stop. On the run. You have a good balance of run and pass on offense. The defense doesn't have a chance to focus in on either one of them. They need to be prepared to cover both options. Second and six. Ball on the 45-yard line. Hey, let's go. The Broncos come out in a 4-3. Pleasant, the man in motion. And it off, running with purpose. Swain comes up to make the play at the 49-yard line. If they can keep getting good runs like that in the second quarter, they'll be able to use play passes the entire second half because the defense will just be thinking about stopping Third the run. Two. Third and a deuce. The, the Broncos line up in a 4-3. Going into halftime, the score is 24-3. to three. Packers. Owen oh, is back and ready to put this one in the air. This one is taken by Terry. The Broncos have their work cut out for them as they take over at the 20. Ball on their own 20. The Packers come out in a nickel package. Rolls right. Pressure coming. Number 29 is there for the tackle at the 20 yard line. Thomas looks to be shaken up after that play, and we'll get you a report from the sideline when we get the information. Second and ten. Ball on the 20 yard line. Get it up! Come on! Dotson starts out of the shotgun. Back, the motion man. With the pass. Turns, he has it. The 40. This one was spotted at the 47 yard line. He found the ball carrier to make his fourth stop of the game. And it's good for a first down. Thomas returns to the game after being shaken up earlier. Well, the counter play. Number 58 stops the play in the backfield. And now our viewers can see how successful each team's main running threat has been today. Second and long. Ball on the 45-yard line. Hey, let's go. Base, 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 base. Green Bay Everybody comes out there. in their nickel oh, pack. Let's go, man. Under pressure with the pass. Ooh, nearly picked off. Good timing. Getting in between the ball and the receiver to save what would have been a big game. The Broncos line up in a five receiver set this time. Rowing. Incomplete. He had to unload that pass in the hurry. Yeah, he felt those guys closing in and gunned the ball out of there. is ready to pump this one away. Number 86. Looks like he's ready for the return. From the 16-yard line. Stiff arm keeps him at bay. Right. 
First and ten. Ball on the 18 yard line. I'll come through, baby. The Broncos line up in a 4 3. This one is handed off. Buckley is there for the tackle at the 17. They went backward on that one. And that's a very good call by the defensive coordinator. He had a good idea of what was coming, and he called the perfect play to stop it. Second it's second down and a long way to go. On the 17 yard line. Defense, get ready. Only one man in the backfield. Do so, do so. Dropping back. Pressure, throwing on the run. Knocked away. And it will be an interference call on that play. The only question was the defender or the receiver. Swain didn't let him go for the ball. Both the defender and the receiver have a right for the ball. But the defender has to at least pretend he's looking for the pass. They'll get called every time. is there for the tackle at the 37-yard line. I like how this big guy can run with the football. Yeah, and this fullback could do more than just get out there and lead block. Give him the ball and watch him rumble. Second and one. Ball on the 37-yard line. No more, fellas. The defense lines up in the nickel. Dropping back with the throw. This pass is incomplete. He had plenty on that pass, but it was one target. He has to learn to take a little bit off it sometime. You don't want to try and guide it in there or put it up for grabs, but you also need to give your guy a chance to catch the ball. Third and one. Ball on the 37-yard line. The Broncos line up in a 4-3. Gets rid of it. Pass was incomplete. Plus, was his intended target. Tucker will come in now to punt it away. Terry sets up, waiting for the punt. Fair catch called for. Fair catch made at the 28-yard line. The Broncos will start the drive at the 28-yard line. First and ten. The backs are lined up in an eye. I'll come through, baby. Hey, watch that three! Closing in. Great play by the veteran linebacker. He's still a very strong competitor, and he loves the blitzing game. Now they're looking at second and long after the sack. Pressure coming. And the pass was incomplete. Pass. That short pass Thomas. is incomplete. It'll be third down now. Third Here's a look at the third down success ball rate ball of each team. Yard. Green Bay lines up with seven guys Get in the down. secondary. Uh -huh. ball. Ball. The blitz is on. With the pass, Warren comes up to make the play at the 39. On third and long, the defense is playing pass all the way. They just can't come up with a stop. Watch it here. The quarterback looks and fires one, and the defense is left to wonder how they let him off the hook. He tucks it away. Putman 
is there for the tackle. He's there to make yet another outstanding defensive play. He made a name for himself with plays like that. He's one of those guys that every defensive coordinator would love to have on his team. He's smart, he plays with good intensity, and he's a heck of a leader on and off the field. Hey, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Dotson spreads them out. Play hard to play. With the throw. This pass is incomplete. Number 29, Hockham, to save a big play. Green Bay lines up with seven guys in the secondary. Dropping back. Throws it. Nearly intercepted. He's back in his zone. He's reading. He sees the quarterback the whole way. And then he gets a chance at an interception. He just didn't finish the play. Comes into the game for the punt. Number 86. Back to return. From the 27-yard line. 33-yard punt. Return for a gain of two yards. The Ball Panthers on their own 29. Start the drive at the 29-yard line. First and 10. Everything you've got. The Broncos with a four-man front. He hands it off. Number 37 is there on the stop at the 34-yard line. The best backs in the league average four to five yards a carry. But there are a lot of things that go into a successful running game. You got to have good play calling, good blocking up front, and a back that can take advantage when he sees the opening. Don't stop, don't stop that motor. No more, son. The Packers line up in the bunch formation. Gets the pass off, and this pass is completed. Fawn is there for the tackle at the 48 yard line. Number eight has been in lockstep with his receivers all season long. He's now thrown for over 3,000 yards. First Three ten. minutes remaining in the quarter. Watch the snap now. Stay close now. The Packers come out with three receivers tight. Rowing. The wide receiver has it. The 30. They're going to spot this one at the 25-yard line. He wraps up the ball carrier, and his tackle total is now four. Holt makes another catch to put him over the 100 mark in the game. Line up in a 4 3. Here we go. Uh -huh. Keep moving. So we're going to take it. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Hand it off. Number 94 is there on the stop at the 23 yard line. Wilson takes advantage of a little daylight, picks up three yards. Second and eight. Ball on the 23 yard line. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Number eight from the shotgun. Tucks it away. Blaze comes up to make the play. At the 19, Wilson rumbles forward for a gain of four. Ball on the 19-yard line. Ball on the 19-yard line. Hey, let's go one deep. Their last red zone trip resulted in a touchdown. Hand off to the tailback. Number 57 is there for the tackle at the 12. Wilson fighting for yardage that time. He's able to reel off a nice game. So they have 12 yards to go for a touchdown. Denver lines up in a 4-3. Number eight with a man in motion. They 
give it to the halfback. Runs it in. Swain is there on the stop at the seven. Wilson picks up some tough yards there. They have seven yards to the end zone. The Broncos come out in a 4-3. Going to the right. Strong move. Swain comes up to make the play. Simpson busted through for a few tough yards. Not the play of this drive. They're inside the five. The offense has been stepping it up on third down all day. Good read by the defense there as they knew the quarterback was going to run with it and they shut him down. He shouldn't have any problems with this attempt. Owens hangs that one right through his second field goal of the game. They've extended the advantage to 24 points with that field goal. This one is taken by Terry. The Broncos need to rebound quickly as they start this drive at the 20. Ball on their own 20. Start the drive at the 20 yard line. First and 10. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Back and back. Gives the ball off. Oh, oh, great. Warren comes up to make the play. They might not be busting off big game, but those linemen are really working hard down there. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 20 yard line. We turn it up. Here we go, baby. Here we go. Green Bay comes out with seven in the secondary. Throws it. It's batted away. They dropped additional people into the secondary, but still generated an excellent pass rush. And that gives you a lot of flexibility calling your defense. If the guys up front are good at creating pressure, then you don't have to blitz as often, giving you the ability to double cover an opponent's best receiver. The defense has had difficulty stopping them on third down. Dropping back. Gets rid of it. And it's caught. Number 29 comes up to make the play. play at the 32. At the end of three, the score is 27 to three. Packers. The score is the Packers. 27. The Broncos. Three. Denver needs to play a perfect fourth quarter if they're going to make a game here. Ball on their own 32. Ball on the 32 yard line. Will, Will, Will. Green Bay comes out with seven in the secondary. Gets the pass off. Complete to the wide receiver. Perry, Perry makes the catch but doesn't get very far. And that's what the mark of a solid defense is. They close in on you in a hurry and they don't miss tackle. Second and seven. Ball on the 35-yard line. It's showtime, Dotson out of the gun. Here they come. Incomplete as the defender knocks it away. And he throws incomplete because he had major pressure. The corner came on a blitz and he sprinted for the quarterback. Guys love the opportunity to get a sack. And that time he just missed taking him down. Seven. Ball on the 35-yard line. Defense get ready. Two quarters. Two quarters. Nice job so far on third down for the offense, and we'll see if that continues here. It's broken up. When you let the defense get into your backfield that quickly, bad things are going to happen to you. Seven. 
Maddox is ready to punt this one away. Number 86 lines up deep for the punt return. Won't take a chance trying to return this one. Fair catch made at the 30-yard line. First Ball on their own 30. Ball on the 30-yard line. it off to the back. Number 94 is there on the stop at the 33-yard line. Short game, big hit by the defensive end. Second and seven coming up here. Ball on the 33-yard line. The Broncos come out in a 4-3. Fawn is there for the tackle at the 34-yard line. Wilson gets the handoff on the delay, brings it ahead for about a yard. Third it's third down and six, and six to go. Ball on the 34 yard line. They ain't got nothing. They do our thing. They do our thing. Consistent success on third down, which they've had, usually translates into a win. Green Bay comes up short on third down again. Unable to get anything going on that series, they'll have to punt it away here. And so the punt goes out of bounds. This is one of those situations where they're playing for respect. The game really hasn't gone the way they thought it would, but they have a lot of pride in their team. And I'd expect to see them keep fighting for that final whistle. Ball on their own 45. They'll go from the I formation. Hands it off. Great fake. Long throw. He has it. Number 29 is there for the tackle at the 19. This is what they have to do. Keep making completions down the field and move the chains. Watch this one. He knows he's got to get the first, and he picks the right guy to throw it to. Gets the pass off. Incomplete. So, second down upcoming. Second and ten. Ball on the 19-yard line. And the fans finally get to see their red zone offense. Firing the ball into the end zone. Almost in the Oh, man, he had it in the end zone, but dropped it. That's the second worst thing that can happen to a defender, to drop one like that. The absolute worst thing is to have your man beat you for six. Third and ten. Ball on the 19-yard line. No stop, no stop that motor. Key series here as they're in the red zone trying to stay in the game. He hits his receiver. Gore is there on the stop. This is a guy who comes to play, and he seems to make big catches when they really need him. This time, they needed to convert on third down, and he's there for the reception and the first down. Watch the snap down. He'll sneak it. Trent is there for the tackle. He calls his own number, picks up yardage. It's second and goal at the three-yard line. Green Bay comes out in their nickel package. He was tipped. 
Perry drops the pass in the end zone. Good play call. John just couldn't bring it in, so it looked like a sure touchdown. He's been struggling recently with his consistency making catches. But when a quarterback can find you in the end zone and hit you in the hands, you got to come up with it. And here's what they've been able to do so far on third down. They've done very well on third down to this point. Looking for the corner. Number 58 created problems in the backfield on that play. No can do. The defense comes up with a stop on third and goal. Fourth down and goal to go. I don't think they have a choice. They have to go for it. To the end zone. Almost picked off. Trying to get it into the end zone on fourth and goal. They don't make it. They'll take over at the six yard line. First and ten. Yeah, you see me. Do something, do something. The Broncos with a four man front. From the start, from the start. Hands okay, it right. off. Setting up play action. Gets rid of it. This pass is incomplete. Pass and Aaron Pass that time. Pleasant, the intended receiver on the play. Second and ten. Ball on the six-yard line. Hey, watch that screen! Come on! The Broncos come out on a dive back. Jigs off the tackle. He's brought down behind the line for a short loss. This defense has some good speed. So when you try something to the outside and you fail to get those outside guys blocked, well, you're in trouble. Ball on their own five. Ball on the five-yard line. Off to the tailback. Williams is there for the tackle at the 11. The third down run, not enough to keep the drive alive, so the punting team coming in. There's nothing wrong with trying to grind it out in the fourth quarter when you're playing with a lead. So three and out, and they'll line up to punt. He's waving for the fair catch. Fair it sure doesn't look like they're going to be able to come back in this one. But it's an issue of pride. They want to prove that they're better than they've played so far. They'll start the drive at the 49-yard line. First and 10. Back, the lone back. They give it to the halfback. Great fake. Gets the pass off. Peterson is there on the stop at the 24. This is what they have to do. Keep making completions down the field and move the chains. Watch this one. He knows he's got to get the first, and he picks the right guy to throw it to. The yards that these receivers make after the catch are a great indication of their physical ability. It shows that they are creative. But they can create yards by using their speed and making the defenders miss tackle. Nothing doing that time, John, as the linebacker gets there quickly. He's one of those guys who's a sure tackle. He'll move up and play physically at the line, come on a blitz, and play the run just about as well as anyone on the defense. It's second down and 10 to go. Under pressure with the pass. Wide receiver has it. Perry didn't have much room to do anything with that one. Yeah, they had the coverage, and they made the sure play instead of trying something fancy, like going for the pick. The 14-yard line is where they have to go to pick up the first down. Dotson starts out of the shotgun. Pumps once with the throw. Broken up. Yet another drop for him. Perry, the intended receiver on the play. Danny, Danny, Danny. Keep it up. Is it slack going? Let us get to it. Say, no, we know what's coming. Do what we do. Right here. Huh? Let's get some power back, though. Huh? Huh? 
it off to the back. Number 58 comes up to make the play. At the 13, he finds his way just past the first down marker. They're inside the 15. Only one man back. Throwing. Loose to the wide receiver. Thomas makes the catch for a short gain of three yards. Nine yards will get them six points. Nine yards. From the start, from the start. Hey, let's go. The Packers come out on a nickel pack. So a fly to the end zone. Drops the interception. Dropped in the end zone, so the offense still has possession. And that's the last thing you want as a defender, to have the ball go right through your hands in the end zone. Almost at the two-minute mark now. The Packers come out with three down linemen and seven defensive backs. The blitz is on. With the pass, he hits his receiver. Number 29 records the tackle at the two. The defense blitzes the corner, but the quarterback got rid of it quickly for a completion and a first down. That was a great play because he saw him coming, remained calm, and threw an accurate first pass. Goal. It's first and goal at the two-yard line. The Broncos line up in the bunch formation. Firing a ball into the end zone. Ooh, nearly picked off. Yeah, if he could have come up with that one, not only does it take away the scoring threat, but it gets the ball back for your offense. It's second and goal at the two. The Broncos line up in a five receiver set this time. Dragged down from behind. Boom! And where'd that truck come from? And here's a look at each team's success on third down so far. Defense, get ready. Danny, Danny, Danny! Come on! Pressure with the pass. This one falls incomplete. He barely got that one off. Yeah, it wasn't a sack. What it did was make the quarterback adjust his throw and it messed up his rhythm. It appears they're going to go for it, and here's how they've done so far. No stop, no stop, that motor. Let's go. Difficult situation here, but not much else they could do but go for it. They're blitzing, intercepted in the end zone. So he throws the fourth quarter interception. He just should have tucked it away and run with it. After that turnover, here's how both teams are doing in that department. First Following the interception, it's now first and ten. Only one man back. Time, gives the ball off. Bumble, loose ball. This guy always gives maximum effort on every play. It doesn't matter if you're asking him to well, run between the tackles or outside. He just field. takes a ball and refuses to be brought down by the tackle. And we'll take a few looks to determine whether the ball came out before the knee was down. The key thing here is that the ball started to come out before his knee was down. If it did, then it should be counted as a fumble. No fumble occurred. It was unclear initially why they called for a review, but now we understand the reason. You have to give it to these officials. Their job's not easy. Sometimes they make mistakes, but most of the times they're right. The Broncos come out in a 
Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Danny, Danny, Danny. Hey, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Not today. On the carry. Williams is there on the stop. Wilson manages a yard or two on the delay play. Third and five. Ball on the 13 yard line. Here we go, baby. Let me go. Let's go now. Hulk goes in motion. No more, fella. And they go with the delay. Williams is there for the tackle at the 15-yard line. They played it safe, stayed on the ground, nothing doing. Tucker will come in now to punt it away. Terry sets up to run back the punt. is running out they'll have to keep the ball in the air first and ten ball on the 49 yard line defense get ready come on bring it up bring it up play hard and fast baby oh, hey, let's go, it's the pace game. off the defenders got it the 30 the 20 the 10, 5, touchdown, Packers. Exactly what they had to do. Force the bad throw, get the takeaway, return it for the score. Comes in for the extra point. The extra point attempt is good. The Packers pour it on with another score. This one is handled by Terry. The first and ten will start the drive at the 20 yard line. First and ten. Hold the look. Dotson scans the defense from the gun. Hey, watch the ball. They ain't got nothing. Closing in with the throw. Nearly intercepted. Thomas was the one they were trying to get the ball to. Number 29 with the coverage. Second and 10. Ball on the 20 yard line. Second and run. The Packers come out in a nickel package. Trying something to the left. Almost intercepted. So this could be the last play of the game. On the 20 yard line. Let's go. All day, baby. Come on. Green Bay comes out in their nickel package. Keep the throttle down. Here we go, baby. Rock and roll. Dropping back. Looked like movement up front. Here's the referee's call. The pass ball's incomplete. That's all right. The defender was a little too aggressive on that ball. And what they do is anticipate the count sometimes. 
And that time, he was just half a beat early. Third they were looking five. at a third and Ball five here after the penalty. Yard line. Green Bay comes out in their nickel package. Drops back, throwing. Brooks is there for the tackle at the 45. This game reaches its conclusion with the final score, Green Bay 34, Denver 3. For EA Sports, this is Al.